Welcome to A Day in the Life. I'm glad you're here. While you're here, make sure you subscribe and also hit the notification bell so that you will be notified for future videos. Blessings. Hello everyone, we are back on our smoothie kick. My son in love, my oldest daughter's husband made a smoothie and it was so yum. Okay, so I decided to stop at the clean juice shop to see if I could get me a smoothie that would taste just as good. And that's where we are. This shirt is so cool. And this is this clean juice shop. Well, he had some flax seed and I dropped the chia seed on the floor. Okay, when I was trying to make this smoothie sweeter, cause it, they, their sweet, their smoothies are not that sweet, guys. And yeah, I, wa I wasted some of the seed on the floor. Okay, this is what I cooked that night. I cooked some baked chicken and also some broccoli and cheese casserole with also kale in it, and that was pretty good. Convenient meeting on Zoom. Day outside. Filet meals. What's the drink? Uh, a sweet tea. A sweet tea and a Sprite. What else for you? That's it. For C92 at the window, please. Filet, filet o fish. Filet o fish at McDonald's. Those are really yum. But I was thinking, you know who would have a really yummy fish sandwich? That would be Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A! We have a good, good Chick-fil-A um, fish sandwich. A fish sandwich. So if anyone's watching this video from Chick-fil-A, yeah, right. Yeah, add a fish, fish sandwich to your menu. Bing! Good idea. Mm -hmm. Or Canes. Canes can have a fish sandwich. Someone, y'all should have a fish sandwich. You know, Wendy's have a fish sandwich during time that's close to Easter, and theirs is pretty yum. But I mean, like, on the caliber of Chick-fil-A will be good. Chick-fil-A! Yeah, it's a beautiful day, you guys. It's a beautiful day. Take a look. That's what I'm doing. Just getting some lunch. Then I go back to the house. It was a good day so far. I mean, a productive day. I was able to chime in on a Zoom. Zoom. Um, meeting class, if you will, um, and that was that was good. And so I loaded up a vlog. Okay, and that was good. And so now I'm going to have lunch. I'm gonna go back home, and I'm gonna do some cleaning. Um, Do some cleaning and some reading. <sighs> Thank you, Lord, for this day. This is McDonald's. Some ranch, also, please. You've got the and a fries? Yes. Mm -hmm. Um, two. Yes. Yep, everything looks good. The fries have to be just right for me. With McDonald's fries. If they too hard, no. 
I can't I can't roll with the hard fries. That goes for anyone. I like soft fries. Just some people like crunchy. I like soft fries. Okay, so much enough checking in. See you in a bit. This store you gotta come in. You have to wear this mask in this store because this store gives up all the guys. I like where your mask at. Looking for some chia seed because I waste some. I waste some of his chia seed on the floor, so I had to sweep all of that wasted chia seed up and throw in the trash can. So now I'm, I, I decided to replace it, and uh, yeah. So I didn't have the same brand as he had, but this is. I mean, it's the same, I guess, and it's called chia seed. And I was also looking for some some tea here. They have a wide selection of tea, all different goodies in the store, organic type stuff. So yeah, I got some more tea and some chia seed. Okay, getting ready to make that smoothie here. I have bananas, I have also spinach, and I have assorted fruit, um, cantaloupe, mango, watermelon, and I got some almond milk, and I got some of that organic chia seed. And um, yeah, this little old blender here is one that didn't cost oh i got spinach as well it didn't cost that much i got it at walmart i think it was like 15 bucks and um, we have another blender that would work much better but i just decided to just use this little small one so it'd just be enough for a cup and um yeah so you it's probably best to use a larger blender than the one i used here I thought it would be okay, you know, just if I'm making enough of one glass. But yeah, but I would recommend using a larger uh, blender. I tried doing it the easier way. I thought fruit that was like already assorted fruit, you know, like a fruit, fruit cocktail, you know, packaging. I would suggest getting your fruit fresh individually and just cutting it up because the fruit cocktail taste uh, is different than like the clean juice shop. You know, it's it'll feel, it, it'll feel off more of a fresh, fresher taste, if that makes sense, versus covered up fruit sugary fruit taste, you know? So yeah, I would suggest doing that. In the next video is, remember Jesus loves you and God so loved the world that he gave. He gave his only begotten son, y'all, that whoever believe in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Now that's love. I'll see you next time in the next video. And again, blessings.